Hello and welcome my students. This is a CC Mass PHY101 class. This is going to be lesson one and we will talk about inertial frame of reference. I am Shuaibu Muawi Asalan Kanu and today being 17th July 2023. Okay, as quickly as possible, what are our learning objectives? We have just two learning objectives. The first one is to define an inertial frame of reference. What is an inertial frame of reference? And the second one is to give at least three examples of an inertial frame of reference. Okay, let's see the definition. What what is an inertial frame of reference? What do, uh, of reference? What what does it mean? An inertial frame of reference is a frame of reference that is either at rest, and when it is at rest, we know the velocity is zero. It has zero velocity. It's not moving. Or that it is moving, but with uniform velocity, not just any velocity, but uniform. It has to be constant, not changing. And if it is at rest, or it is uh, moving with uniform velocity, we know the acceleration has to be zero. So this is why they say this means that it is not accelerated in any direction okay now what are the examples of an inertia frame of reference okay here here are the few examples a physics laboratory at rest on the surface of the earth we know that the physics lab is not moving okay if i'm taking measurement uh, on a physics lab the lab is at rest so my coordinates if it is in the lab then it is an inertial frame of reference. Or that I have a car moving along a straight line, the direction is not changing, with a constant velocity of 60 km per hour. This is also an inertial frame of reference. The velocity is constant. A plane, you have aeroplane moving horizontally due north with a uniform velocity of 160 km per hour. Because the velocity is not changing, whether in magnitude or in direction, that makes it an inertia frame of reference. So we have three examples of inertia frame of reference and we also saw their uh, definition. And lastly, I have to thank you all for watching. Thank you for watching.